Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be checking out Project Grove, which is like a platforming puzzle game that seemed like it was pretty cool, so I thought I would check it out. So let's go ahead and hop in. The engineer pins have left cool. a service analysis for you. It will inform you about the immediate area. 1EP1N has left a sample from a new flora they located. Marvelous. Would you kindly show me to that service analysis? All right, I thought I turned subtitles on. It might not have saved it correctly. Yeah, it looks like I'm having trouble with my options actually being saved because I want to turn motion blur down and I want to keep that that way. Seems like it's good now. I also couldn't use a controller with this game. I was having some issues with that, so. Also, my my turn radius is super, super fast, so. I'm, I'm sorry if this disorients you, actually. Let, let me let me turn that down a bit, too. I am moving way too quickly. Probably because my DPI on my mouse is just naturally set high. There we go. So now we're good. So let's explore a bit. I've heard this is a pretty short demo, but the game looked super interesting, so I wanted to check it out. Ooh. Got some pretty environments. Got a nice little house here, too. I don't know why we have so many barrels, though. Hello, thing. This is perfect. Ooh, that was loud. I didn't know- the I- Service analysis reports possible magical readings. Let's go take a look. Alright, well, I guess subtitles have decided no. I mean, obviously the game- this, this is a demo and the game is early. So, these things are to be expected. Whoa, what is that? Excuse me? Also, since I am using keyboard, prepare for some clicks and or clacks to be assailing your ears. Anything back here? There's some floating rocks. Can I hop that? I can. This old sounding man. Hi. Whoa. Hello. Why did you just appear in front of my face? Locate the magical disturbance. I mean, I'm guessing it's that thing way down there. Interact with the winch by looking at it and pressing E. Oh. Okay, so that's that's to go down. I don't think I want to use this yet. I think I want to go in here first. I mean, I'm sure that elevator isn't a one-way trip, but how about we investigate this while we're up here? Greetings from Potentium HQ, Mr. Tate. What a pleasure it is to be working with you. Let me introduce myself. I am Lorna Casely from Human Resources. But, you know, I think of it more as humans relating. <laughs> uh, because... That's what HR is really all about. A trade secret for you. Anyway, let me just say, right off the bat, I'm so honored to be overseeing this expedition. Anything I can do to help you, please. Ciao, ciao. All right, we're actually gonna need to see if we can turn this down a little bit because the voice, the voices can in particular get pretty loud. All right, I turned it down a tad. So hopefully that's a little bit better because I didn't see any audio options in the game settings. Whoa, I'm. Hmm. Ah yes, the exceedingly obvious glowing plant. Yeah, that's what I was saying. It's exceedingly obvious. I kind of phased through the rock right there, but the, this, this is this is the kind of thing I like when I play like the early access demos on itch and stuff. Not only did you get to see the games, like, in their earliest point and kind of see them grow up, it's also just neat to see funny little things like that, and to help the developers find these things, of course. The game runs pretty well so far. I did turn off motion blur, just usually because I'm not a massive fan of motion blur. Usually it hurts my eyes a little bit if I play games with motion blur a bit too long. I don't know if there's even going to be anything here in this area I'm exploring right now, but I thought I would check it out anyway. I see these weird demonic gates, if that is the correct term for them, but I don't really see much with the, to do with them. I wonder if this red bar is above. Do I have health? Can old man take damage? I don't know. Hmm. Well, okay, I guess let's do like they said and go towards the energy source. Oh wait, what was that? I clicked. Whoop. Oh, I can make you a platform? Hmm. Okay, that's neat. I like that. Ooh, I might- ooh. Okay, yeah, that's damage being taken. 
Sorry, Brambles. I didn't mean to. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be over here yet, but... Dropping me in a world like this kind of just makes me want to explore. So, I'm gonna do it. Oh, go up a little higher, thank you. Uh... Night. Hmm. Okay, there we go. We can't get high enough. Anything to do with this plant? Did I come up here for no reason? Ooh, there's that. I don't know if I can make that jump. Hmm. It's shiny though, so I want it. Can I... do that maybe? Is this enough? Go, old man powers activate! Oh, there was... Platform umbrella thing for me here, please. There was a... Ah. Uh, there was a collect prompt, but I didn't press it fast enough. Yeah, you know what? How about we wait on this for now? I gave it a shot. Maybe we'll get okay, something else later. Here. So, why don't we just go with that assumption? Seems like there's another one of those, so that might be the collectible of this particular game. Hey. Might need a hand here. Yeah, I already, already found out how to do that because I'm stupid and I went exploring off of my own. Is this cake? Straight into the back. Oh, it's moss. Direct L pin to a location. Press space to jump. Okay, so this is what I should have done before just have the initials PB on them. I'm not sure, Ooh. Hendrick. Hello. Restricted files. Ooh. Access denied. Formal request to Potentium HQ. No, no, no. Abort. I collected a life leaf. Oh, that's what that plant was. I saw hearts coming off of it, but I wasn't sure. It seems like Hello. we collect are collecting like alchemical ingredients as well. Marvelous. I wonder if we're ever going to use Hello. these hey. for anything, or if they're just a collectible. Interested to know that. I quite like the gameplay so far, though. It's pretty fun. You move pretty fluidly, and the platforming with this particular thing seems pretty neat. Hey. I do like games like hey. this. Please stand on my head and escalate. Hold marker to adjust position. Yeah, I got that. Alright, so right there. Hey. Hop. Whoop. Hello, Moss. Just what I was looking for. Is it? I see. This is a very talkative old man. Um, let's do that, I guess. Hmm. There we go. I just need a little bit of extra boost to get up there. Got some roots down there. Hmm. How do we actually... Oh. I completely missed this. It seems like the uh, snapping for the platform that you put down is pretty good too. Look, a flora magica. Flora magica often have enchantments to protect themselves from being destroyed, much like how a thorn can protect a rose from being picked. Hmm. Unlock the first glyph. Follow the purple flora roots to locate glyphs and unlock the barrier. All right, will do. Yeah, I'm digging this so far. This is pretty neat. It reminds me of... I'm on, Elpin. It reminds me of Lost Ember, kind of mixed with... Maybe Superland? Just because you clearly get powers and stuff. Follow the purple flora roots. Okay, so just stepping on it unlocked the flora root, as it were. Alright, well, how do we get to this one? Ow. Just broke my legs. It's fine, though. He's an old man. Those, those, those things will get better in, like, no time, won't they? Yeah, totally. That's... That's how it works. And... Can I... I'm, I can't catch that. Yeah. I was thinking if I put it low enough that I could kind of fall and catch it. Collect. Fern's gotten. I wonder what these are going to be used for, I... Imagine in the full game. Hmm. How does one go about getting over there? Oh, cool! That's some, uh, neat bit of, uh... It's a term called... Columnar jointing. Huh. Cool. Have to look into that. It's like a- it's like when you see the little hexagonal columns thing. That's what it's called. A YouTuber that I watch. Ugh! Oh, no. 
Oh no. <laughs> Edric has died. And I revived. Cool. Didn't mean to die. Sorry, Erdrick. Hey! Whoop. Hey! And hop. And hop. There we go. So this is the next glyph. These structures are an alchemic symbol. Ooh. They probably have a power source. Okay. That's neat. So we have like little Seems like things we have to put in places. To like button this. or not buttons, but something to activate ah. a source. Flat objects can be pushed by interacting with them. Uh, you have to be level to push the boulder. Oh, okay. I can just run into it. Whoa! That was a loud sound effect. Whew. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> I was saying that you can kind of just push it by running your face into it. You don't even have to press E, really. Whoop. Definitely looks like there's some stuff going on down there. This does seem really, really cool, though. I like the level of environment interaction in this game. Hey. That's what reminds me the most of it, uh, the what? most of Superland, in particular. Because, like, Lost Ember and Mythic Ocean, they didn't have... Well, Mythic Ocean didn't have any problem solving whatsoever. Uh, besides, it was mostly just a dialogue-driven game. But this and Lost Ember had quite a few puzzles, but sometimes Lost Ember had environmental interactions because you did take on different animal uh. forms. Well, you really can't take a drop that well, can you? Hmm. Okay, let's just go down the safer way. Except not too safe. Are you coming? You can check your quests and inspect your inventory at any time by pressing P. Alright, can we see stuff? Yeah, there's... Oh, this is a service analysis. This an analysis. Service analysis of immediate area surrounding the Krima base. Mana... Intensities detected with 74% likelihood scans indicate convergence of magical energy at coordinates northwest of base analysis, likelihood of flora magica high. Can't say I'm particularly impressed with this. If these robots had cared to look out the window, they would have seen the bloody thing that they're 74% likely sure exists. They also see we've got a bit of a problem on our hands getting to the damn thing. Mother's Rumos is an uncommon plant found across the Crema and the Empire's colonies to the west of it. Okay, so these do seem like just collectibles. Maybe they'll be upgrade materials at some point. That would be interesting. Maybe we can make it so our old man doesn't die from dropping two feet. Hey. Go ahead, hoppity hop. I don't think I can get up there, actually. Hey. So let's ignore that for now. Ah. Good old columnar jointing. This is an entire cave of it, actually. Neat. Are you coming? All right, I think I just need to touch this door. Hey or not. Up. Well, the, okay. Oh, wait, no, it's probably connected to, yeah, okay. I see what you're putting down. Boom. Hey. Whoop. And hey. up. Go ahead and collect myself another mushroom. Tom. Ah. Ow. Bloody hell. There we go. I'm Bloody hell. Okay, so those are keys. Interesting. Yes, hello. Over I didn't need to crouch, but thank you. Over Just here? Who I'll said that? Of this. Who said come over here? I want a name, damn it. Please evacuate the plant I can expand the area. Sorry. Didn't mean to get in your way. I can't do it if you're looking. Hey! Oh, you can't do it if I'm looking. That's a funny line of dialogue. I like that. Whoop. Poor embarrassed. Hey. Uh, what is this thing Let called? Let me out the way before you open that thing. Hmm. I can actually recall the name. Seapid, I believe. Thank you. Hey. Yeah, the platforming feels pretty fun with this little uh, gimmick we have going here. Hey. I quite like it. All right. So this door. So what? Yeah, we need. We came all the way up here, but we need the. We need that other key. I'm a fool. I was doing all of that for no reason. Without you, Elpin. So let me just pick up that key again. We. Oh. Okay. So we have a little bit of a puzzle here. Ooh, I see what I need to do. I see exactly what you're putting down, game. This puzzle just totally went over my head the first time. So that's why it was giving me the crouch tutorial. 
I just didn't even notice. Get in there. Go, go, go. Okay, where does it exactly come down? I think it's like right there. Hello. So now if we go grab the key and come over here. Yeah, we can crouch under this. Can't be good for the old guy's legs. And up we go. Might need a hand. Do our little uh, platforming rigmarole again. And hop. At least the door is actually open now. It's green. That means good. Hey. He does like saying hoop and hey. Ah, hey, hoo hoo, hey, hey. He's a Mario in his own Get right. Over here. Hmm. Hi. Hmm. There's a health plant right there. Mushroom for me to collect. How am I supposed to get the egg up there, though? Eh. Go. Can't you, like, throw it? Hey. No. Well, let's explore the room a bit, see if we can come up with a solution hey. to this particular problem. I can't do it if you're looking. Uh, hey. okay, you went a bit high there. I can't actually get up. Hey. There we go. Whoop. Hey. Please, allow me to obtain the mushroom. Eh, let's just look around. Is there something I can do here? That would allow me to get that where I need it to go. Because it needs to be up there, but I can't exactly put it up there. Not right now, at least. Hey. Whoop. Well, this I can grab good. that, at least. Huh. We got another Tom. Hmm... Yeah, this one's stumping me a bit, which honestly isn't hard if you've ever seen me play a puzzle game. It's in, it's in fact quite easy to stump me. Hey. Hey. Actually, I stuck. think I see what I need to do now, but yeah, we gotta go back down here to do it. So I think we need to bring this with us, which handily we can just kind of set it up on platforms that we need it to go to. Could you hey. do that? platform umbrella thing for me here please and now since we can hold this and activate the platform at the same time do need to get a little bit higher i don't think i i don't think i made that platform high enough just slightly higher if you would there we go so now we can use this to get over here yeah yeah all right, and now, hmm, this was kind of my plan. Let, let's see if that works. Ooh. It would probably help if I jumped. Shocking, I know, but that would probably probably be something that helps. Okay, well, up we I go might again. Need a hand here. At least we absolutely know how to do it now, so I can help shouldn't you. be too hard to. Ooh. Get over here again. All right, we're not we're not watching this. I'm skipping this. I will save you from the suffering, poor poor viewer. All right, we got up here. I put it in. That was way harder than it should have been. Let's never talk about this again. Give a name to the flora. Zero zero one two zero zero. Get over here. Oh, I cut off his dialogue by calling him on accident. Oopsie. Didn't sound like it was giving a very interesting name though. Just a bunch of binary. So, we can ignore that. Ooh, more room moss. Will it? Helping over here. Alright, what do we got? Ooh, that's some pretty water, actually. Hi. Is that a jellyfish? Please don't murder me, Mr. Jellyfish. Hey. I would very, very much like for you to not that's murder me. I don't know why I'm picking this stuff up. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do with this yet. And it's, it is a demo, so it's not like I'm going to unlock anything if that is what it does. It's pretty jellyfish. I quite like this area, actually. It's pretty serene. I like it. So our new mission is called Penetration, first of all. And it's Explore the Caves. Yes, I am a child. Why do you ask? 
Hello. What do we have here in the cage? Is more key puzzles that I need the to solve? The bottom of this key plant looks to be the same circumference as your head, Elpin. Key plant seems to be the same circumference as your head. Interesting. Why did you feel the need to point that out? I don't know. Okay, so that opened something? Can we get up there now? Can I hop on top of this and then hop over there? Yeah. I don't know if that was the intended solution, but it is the solution that I came up with. Uh, unfortunately, I also need to get this up here. Huh. Can I stop the door from coming down by having you there? Spawn keys from dispenser plant. Hmm. Is there another dispenser plant up here? No. Let's see, can I reach it from here, I wonder? No. That definitely doesn't seem to be right. Let's just try... If I have you right there, yeah, I should be able to jump right back up. And I... jump! I could not. And I failed. Let's see. Is there a way for me to get back up there? I could go here. Hmm. Oh, it looks like I dropped the key because I walked too far away. Alright, well, give me a couple of seconds to set this puzzle back up and see if we can maybe solve it. So, I wonder... That's... that's way too high. I was trying to see if I could maybe put it a little bit higher. It's about the same height. If I do that, is that enough? I think I maybe need to place it a, even a bit higher than that. Dispense key. Can I pick it up? Come on. Maybe if I crouch? Dispense new key. Aha! I got it. That doesn't feel like the correct way to solve this, but I did it. So that's what matters. All right, is this the last one, possibly? I guess I need to jump into the water so I don't die. Ooh. That rushing effect was pretty cool. Hey, we have a breath meter as well. I didn't get up out of that water. Elpin, find us a way out. The only possible exit point is up. Well, I guess we're going to be rising with the water then, huh? You good? Thanks for playing. That was Elpin over here. So that appears to be it for the demo for Project Grove. That was pretty neat, actually. I'm quite interested in a full game of that. It's just the the environments were very nice. The characters seem kind of interesting. The world seems kind of interesting. So yeah, I'm into that. Um, and the the music was very good as well, as we can see here on the uh, on the um start screen. So yeah. That was a fun little adventure. Didn't have too terribly hard of puzzles, which I like because that means I can actually solve them and I don't look like an idiot, except for the two times that I had to cut because I look like an idiot, so. All right, well, I hope you've enjoyed this quick look at Project Grove and I will see you next time. As always, I will put the link to the game in the description if you want to play it yourself. See you then.